Say we are. Um, all right, Shalom. First and foremost, all praises on the glory to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Yahweh Kodash. Double honors to the apostles. It sounds like you better for this thing in sincere, the truth, and the charity. All right, this is now we have the lesson to the power Yahweh Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Yahweh Kodash. With Yahweh's name, we have the Father, Yahweh Shai's name, the Son, Bahasham is in the name, and Yahweh Kodash. It means the Holy Spirit literally translated as Spirit Holy. All right, through the gift of the, of the Holy Spirit, man, that's how we're able to understand the scriptures, preach this word, have faith, and, and to walk this path, man. The gift being, you know, from Yahweh Bashami, Yahweh Shai. All right, and today, you know, the Spirit will protect your own, you know, like the title says, man, the thief. The thief of the world, man. The man who's gathered the whole planet, all right, by, by violence, all right, by trickery. All right, who's done that? In fact, and you can get Isaiah the 10th chapter. Who, who, who else is coming? The whole world, man. Only one people's done that so called white man. You get Isaiah 10, start at first song. Um, seven. This is um Isaiah 10, verse 7. It says, How be it he meaneth not so. Neither doeth his heart think so, but it is his but it is in his heart to destroy and cut off nations, not a few. All right, and so Esau is just in his spirit to, to, to cut these, these nations out, to take over these nations, man. All right, and he didn't he didn't think he was gonna do it at one point, and but through the spirit of the Lord, he's done it. All right, the Lord said about to do this, he's done it. All right, to destroy it and cut off nations, not a few, man. He's taking over the whole planet. Go ahead. For he said, Are not my princes altogether kings? Is not Kauno as uh, Karkamish? Is not Hamath as Arpad? Is not Samaria as Damascus? Damascus? Right. So he's like, Look, am I not, not my people as good as these, these kingdoms there? Are not we as good as Israelites that's supposed to be rulers? So the more he conquered, the more he couldn't help but what happened, man. He really wanted to gain the world. All right? He couldn't be satisfied. He had grabbed one nation out. It's not good enough. Grab another nation and say, good enough. Not my kings and not my children better than these other kings, man. She we should have a rulership over these people too, man. Go ahead. As my hand hath found the kingdoms of the idols, in whose graven images did excel them of Jerusalem and of Samaria, shall I not, as I have done unto Samaria and her idols, so do to Jerusalem and her idols? So Lord, you to take this man. Where? And the rest of the world, man. Wherefore it shall come to pass that when the Lord hath performed his whole work upon Mount Zion and on Jerusalem, I will punish the fruit of the stout heart of the king of Assyria and the glory of his high looks. Right. This ain't talking about ancient Assyria. One of you read down ancient Assyria and you get this destruction that's written. It's talking about uh, um, the, the new Assyria, the new Babylon. Assyria and Babylon is the same king, technically, man. It was the same people that ruled Babylon and ruled Assyria. All right, it's talking about uh, the daughter of Babylon, man, the daughter of Assyria. It's talking about America. For he saith, by the strength of my hand, I have done it, and by my wisdom, for I am prudent. And I have removed the bounds of the people and have robbed their treasures, and I have put down the inhabitants like a valiant man. There you go. And who's done this, man? Took over the, the, the whole world, man. Got, every, got control of everybody's resources. And everybody in debt, the whole world is in debt, man. Who are they in debt to, man? All right, the IMF, these fake Jews, man, these crackers. <laughs> this is Isaiah 14 and 4. Uh, I started at 3. It says, And it shall come to pass in the day that the Lord shall give thee rest from thy sorrow and from thy fear, and from the hard bodies when thou was made to serve, that thou shalt take up this proverb from the king of Babylon and say, I have the oppressed ceased, the golden city ceased with over the uh, nation of men. It says you were uh, Revelation 19. So it's was when you know that uh, this is Syrian, this is Babylonian, this uh, Babylon, it says Revelation, man, are all talking about the same, you know. It, um, this is back in Isaiah 10, uh, verse 40 now. 
It says, my hands found as a nest the riches of the people. And as one gathereth eggs that are left, have I gathered all the earth. And there was none that moved the wing or opened the mouth. No, so who's who gathered eggs? It's taking out all the, the, the work, man. I didn't say there was none. The Lord said to stop America and make up from being control, man. Britain went to South Africa, they, they got control of it. All right? And then the various other places, man, where France went to Haiti, France went to parts Africa, they were all over the place. They took over Australia. They covered the fucking world. They covered the world, man. Who else has done that? Nobody. This, this is clearly that, that came over Syria, man. All right, you can um, get it. That's it on that. You can get um, Nahum. Three. The fucking devil, man. It's, it's plain and simple. It's the devil that the Bible speaks of, man. This is uh the book of Nahum, three. You want verse four? Three to point or? This Nahum three and one. Woe to the bloody city! It is full of lies and robbery. The prey departed not. There you go. That bloody city again is talking about Syria, all right, which is America. But he starts off in the first chapter talking about America, which is part of the Syria, all right. He said it's the bloody city, man, filled with lies and robbery, man. We saw Edom is that as the untrustworthy thief, man. Plain and simple. All right, lies and robbery. What did he do? Uh, um, put out a credit system, man. Well, that's called leasing. And it's, and it's, when you're looking for leasing, it means lies. Right? You also saw a, a debt based system, man. And what other time was that happening in history? All right? Let's get down to This verse 4. Because of the multitude of the whoredoms of the well favored harlot, the mistress of witchcrafts that selleth nations through her whoredoms and families. Through her witchcraft. There you go. So we saw even has robbed the nations, all right, through a hoarders, which is basically getting people to get in league with them. How they do that? Look, we're loaning you this, this this money, all right, so you can mine mine your resources, you know, and then you owe us interest on, on what we loan you, which is impossible to pay back. Hey, look, if I could say I just make a new currency right now, I just print out 10 brand new currencies. This we're gonna call it currency, all right. And I get it, he just brought the ass for 10 of them. I tell him, look, you're gonna tell these things that I only I made. You owe me 20. You know, I tell him it's 10 or 10 of them. You owe me when you pay me back, pay me back 12. Where's it gonna get these other two from? They don't exist, only I got these forever in debt to me. Now I own him. And that's what they have done. That's the witchcraft and trickery the, the what they've done, man, and they hoard us, man. Get people to leave with them on this debt based system, man. All right, you should have never trusted this devil, man. Plain as simple, you're gonna trust him. I ain't gonna trust this motherfucker, a cracker that called himself South Africa. The British invaded that place and now they the South Africans. You should have known he was the devil off of that, man. All right? You should have been able to look and say, hey, this guy's a fucking vagabond. I don't have to deal with him. And because you didn't, guess what? He went with his way into everybody's fucking um, uh, lands, man. He gained control over everybody's shit. You should have knew not to trust this motherfucker, man. And now you trip. Hey, this is a rock 36 and 26. Who would trust a thief well appointed that's skipping from city to city? All right. And so called white man tell you that everybody. Hey, they're, they're, the Is they're the Israelites. All right. They're 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 the Greeks. All right. They're um South Africans. All right. They're they're the Australians. They're the, the real Americans. They're the real Brits. And, and so forth, man. They say they every hey, they took over everything, man. And they claim it. And guess what? It's clear that Japan owned the land of um, Europe, the lands of Europe. Japan had Australia. So they said they Japan, but then they go and say they the Israelites, so they saying they shim. And now they said they even fucking we got the inheritance of uh, the Africans, man. They said they have like they say the real fucking uh, uh, Americans, which they came and stole this land, and everybody knows this is modern fucking history. They came and stole this land, 
They claim to be the Americans, man. The real Americans. Everybody else is leaders. The motherfuckers that want to say it first are leaders. That's who you're dealing with, man. You should know not to fucking trust this guy. He's a fucking bad about this way you can go from the beginning of time. That's how he became the Greeks. All right? That's how he became the Romans. That's how he became everything outside of but, but Eden. You can trace every other nation back. But Esau William is just wherever, wherever he at. If he's in Japan, he's the Japanese now. They, they got that. They got the damn last samurai, man. You should not have to fucking trust this devil, man. So called white man is the devil. Nobody else deceived the nations like this, man. Well, that's right. That's right. I got a couple of you speaking on um, the debt system. You're speaking on the money, the currency. This is uh, Jeremiah 51 and 7. It says, Babylon has been a golden cup in the Lord's hand that made all the earth drunken. The nations have drunken of her wine. Therefore, the nations are mad. Because what's the part of Esau's philosophy? The part of that wine, man. It's, it's his debt system, man. It's his money system. You see? And that's how he get the, the people on board, you know? And it goes to Habakkuk 2 and verse 5. It says, Yea, also, because he transgresseth by wine, he is a proud man, neither keepeth at home, who enlargeth his desire as hell, and is as death, and cannot be satisfied, but gathereth unto him all nations, and heapeth unto him all people, man. You see? So he is letting you know who that thief is, man. It says, Shall not all these take up the parable against him, and a taunting proverb against him, and say, Woe to him that increaseth that which is not his? How long? And to him that ladeth himself with thick clay. You know, which that thick clay represents what? That heavy debt, man. You know? But it spoke about and said what, man? To him that increases that which is not his, man. And that's Esau Edom. It says that a, a covetous man is not satisfied with his portion, man. That's Esau, you know? This is John 10. You can get Michael 2, whatever else you can do. This is John 10 and verse um, Seven to 10. Yeah. This is St. John 10 and verse 10. The thief comes not but for to steal and to kill and to destroy. I am come that they might have life and that they might have it more abundantly. All right, and this goes back into what we read in um, the Isaiah. All right, what, what we read in the, um, the Nahum and Habakkuk, man, who's done this, man? The thief came out about to steal, kill, and destroy. And that's what the so called white man has been doing since he's been out the caucus mountains, man. Like, he took down the Moors out of Europe, and he became the Spaniards. He became everything, man. All right. <laughs> He took he took over the papacy, man. The Catholic Church now. Everybody think all the damn pope is practice. All right. They say he's the real Irish. And he's the he's he's everything but who the fuck he is. And he came out, he's he's he's, he's came, stole lands, stole heritages, claimed them for himself. All right, and got everybody on his on his fucking way of living. You should have known better, man. You should have knew how to trust this motherfucker. Now the whole world is in debt. And ready to be marked, man. All right, implanted with the chip. That's what's coming next, man. All right. This is the book of Job, chapter 30, verse 5. It says, They were driven from among men, they cried after them as after a thief. So let's find out who, who is this thief, who is the day is speaking of. To dwell in the cliffs of the valleys, in the caves of the earth, and in the rocks. Hence the name. Caucasian man, you see, so they was driven from a fourth, uh, driven forth from among men, and they cried after him as after a thief, man. You see, so it's letting you know who that thief is, man. It's talking about Esau Edom, man. It's Obadiah one and one. The vision of Obadiah does say after the Lord Yahweh concerning Edom, we have heard a woman from the Lord, and an ambassador sent among the heathen. Arise ye and let us rise up against her in battle. Verse 3. The pride of thy heart hath, I'm going to keep going actually. Behold, I have made thee small upon the heathen, 
Y'all are greatly despised. If when you look across the world, man, hey, everybody is despising this devil, man. Right. They talk about you know, watch Chinese movie, what they call they call him the red devil. They know he come in, work underhanded, and he take over your shit. Yet they all still got tricked into joining him, man, with the hopes of what? Themselves becoming rich. Y'all joined us to Esau Eden with the hopes of becoming rich like the great American was. You know? They can thrive and boom like this place. But all y'all did was rack up debt. We keep going. The fight of thy heart have received thee, thou that dwellest in the cleft of the rock, whose habitation is high, that saith in his heart, who shall bring thee down to the ground? All right? So that um, that thief that will chase the way. All right, into the club, talking about either because he's called, he's the, he's the, um, he's the one that said to be the one that dwells in the flesh of the rocks, the Caucasians, man, the cave dwellers from the Caucasus Mountains. It's that simple. And um, this is the bad luck too about that. This is Ecclesiastes, chapter ten. Well, I got somewhere he looks at. Hey, because uh, uh, not only is he a thief, but he's also a goddamn liar, man, as it is written in the book of Psalms. You know, the wicked are estranged from the womb. They go astray as soon as they be born speaking lies. This is uh, Sirach 20 and 24. It says, a lie is a foul blot in a man, yet is it continually in the mouth of the untaught. Verse 25, right? A thief is better than a man that is custom to lie. But they both shall have destruction to heritage, man. So they both gonna be destroyed. Uh, but, but the point is, a thief is better than a liar. And here it is, Esau, Edom. He's both of them, man. Yeah, they go hand in hand. Thief that escaped from town to town, he said, "Who will trust him?" They go hand in hand, shit. And your, uh, your grandma will tell you that. You lie, you steal. You steal, you will kill. The thief came to not but to steal, kill, and destroy, man. That's crazy. That's crazy. It is, it is the bottom of the page. Now, this is Ecclesiastes 4. And you said he was, you know, that Job over one more time. Yeah. This is uh, the book of Job, chapter 30, and verse 5. It says, They were driven forth from among men. And you can hit one first. It's Job 30 and 1. But now they that are younger than I have me in derision. Whose fathers I would have disdained to have set with the dogs of my flock. Right, and that younger means are uh, insignificant. Right, I mean, they're, they're, they're nothing. Hey, they're foolish people, man. All right, they don't know the Lord. Go ahead. Verse five: They were driven forth from among men. They cried after them as after a thief, to dwell in the cliffs of the valleys, in the caves of the earth, and in the rocks. That's right, and this is us. Uh, this is asking is four thirteen. Better is a poor and wise child than an old and foolish king who will no more be admonished. And that, that's also in the book of Job. Now, if one is saying he's going to let them sit with the dog in his flock, they, they do what with him, man? Esau Edom is contrary to, to, to the scriptures. All right, they're a poppy dog. He said that the wicked say they, they, they cast behind the, 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 the Lord. They said, what prophet is it to them, man? They won't be admonished anymore, right? For out of prison he cometh to reign. All right, so you have to cop his mouth. He did what? He took over a uh, uh, Portugal, Spain, not the captaincy, which then, what's that? That's, that's the rulers of the time. They got to, they got to took over, came rich, so they got power, right? Out of prison, he gets to learn, but also he that is born in his kingdom, he got a court. All right? And that's what we're dealing with. He's on me, man. He got out, all right, he got out, cop his mouth. All right? Took over these different lands, we came to different people, skip from city to city by city. Right? Gang of church, everybody all to get him a deal with him. And now look at you, man. The whole world is a debt, ready to talk pop. Crisis, crisis is not the door. For everybody, man, America, the US dollar is being affected by this shit. All right? Everybody will be all these countries, all these countries, uh, based on at one point off the US dollar. 
So let it go, ain't gonna change nothing. It's too late. The world economy is through. Is y'all all trusted in Steve and y'all knew him? Y'all all knew it was a fucking devil. He went to all these other places and helped them over. But y'all thought it'd be different for y'all. You looked at it as I think I can switch this. And that'd be it. But now look. Fucked up. This is book of Micah, chapter 2, verse 1. It says, Woe to them that devise iniquity and work evil upon their beds. When the morning is light, they practice it because it is in the power of their head. Job 9 and 24, right? It says, And they covet fields and take them by violence and houses and take them away. So they oppress a man in his house, even a man in his heritage. Yep, and you go. So not only do they take your, your, your houses and shit, they take your whole lands, they take your whole countries, they take your whole heritage. All right? They take your whole damn heritage, but they become you. So now they the fucking Australians. They, you hear the story of what they did to the Tasmanians, all right? What they did to the Aboriginals. This is the devil that we that we that we that we dealing with, man. You nations think it's gonna be better for you? Well, you thought it was, now you learn it. All right. Now you learn, but it's too late. You're still trying to figure out another way out. There ain't no other way out, man. Destruction is set. Y'all too deep in being with the devil. It's just what y'all got to deal with, man. These plagues. That's something. Yeah, yeah, I'm still looking for it, bro. All right. And this is Malachi 1. And uh, 3. And I hated Esau and laid his mountains and his heritage waste for the dragons of the wilderness. Whereas Edom said, We are impoverished. We will return and build the desolate places. Thus said the Lord of hosts, They shall build, but I will throw down. And they shall call them the board of wickedness. And the people against whom the Lord and the nation come. So now y'all are learning, and really y'all won't fully get until Esau hey, come down in that great wrath. Man. He fully show his horns to everybody all the way. Job will learn that this is the this is the fucking wicked right here, man. This is the curse. What you charge baby to tell? Hey, this is around 27. And um 17. Curse be he that removed his neighbor's landmark, and all the people shall say, I'm mine. For that alone, and you should know that was fucked up. To go into somebody's land, to 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 to, 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 to fuck completely. Slaughter them and then they claim you're them, man. All right, it's crackers that claim that they fucking Native Americans, man. They fuck it to hell with They say they the real Americans. It's like they do in South Africa. They say they them, they, they they got it by violence, man. That's theirs. That's bullshit. Y'all removing the landmarks, and the Lord is gonna come judge you for that. And that's why I'm back at two. Hey, it says what, man? Let me get it. Hey, this is the back of two. And verse um, 7. Shall they not rise up suddenly that shall bite thee, and awake that shall vex thee, and thou shalt be for booty unto them? Because thou hast spoiled many nations. All the remnant of the people shall spoil thee because of men's blood, and for the violence of the land of the city, and of all that dwell therein. All right? So the nations, I give them to Esau, we have been untrustworthy thief. It took them long enough. Now they're ready to turn on this bitch. Now they're ready to bite this whore back. All right? As this whore been devouring them, they're ready to now devour them back, man. They fucking knew better. You can't call a man a devil and think, well, I can take his gifts, you know, and play the system. No. Now you drink, now you drink of that cup. Now you got to get that destruction. You know, you let that golden cup tempt you to where you sold your own people to this devil, you know, now your destruction is coming. All right? But first, y'all y'all get to bite this devil back. But destruction is coming, man. What is it? Second Air 16 talks about the hope of Moab. All right, you thought you was going to be his back. You partaking in Babylon hope. Hey, you, you gooks, you Chinese, man, y'all got a great destruction coming. Y'all thought y'all got a way out this shit. Y'all got a big with Esau weed in America. Y'all found the way out of it. No. When this bubble, when this bubble pop, it's popping for the whole world. Mm 
Because at the day, y'all all still with the iron left, man. Now, the same crap is that that's over here in America. There's no difference. Got something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Proverbs 29 and 24 says, Whoso is partnered with a thief hateth his own soul. He heareth cursing and bereath it not. You know, so like you were saying, man, they, they, they sold out their own uh, selves, their own people, you know, just to be in partners with this devil, man, to be in partners with this thief. Which is this is um Sirach 14 and 4. It says, He that gathereth by defrauding his own uh defrauding his own soul gathereth for others that shall spend his goods riotously. He that is evil to himself, to whom will he be good? He shall not take pleasure in his goods, man. Hey, because not only is Esau even fucking over uh, 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 the people of the earth, but also his own people, man. You know, it says. There is none worse than he that envieth himself, and this is a recompense of his wickedness. And if he doeth good, he doeth it unwillingly, and at the last he will declare his wickedness. <clears throat> and this is all Esau Edom, man. You see, it says, The envious man hath a wicked eye, he turneth away his face and despiseth men. A covetous man's eye is not satisfied with his portion. And the iniquity of the wicked drieth up his soul. A wicked eye envieth his bread, and he is a niggard at his table, man. And that's Esau Edom. He heapeth unto him all the resources, he heapeth unto him all the things that's profitable, man. Hey, and, and, and he's stingy as hell when it comes uh, for him to give it out, you know? Because that's what the word niggard means. It means stingy, man. You see? And that's Esau's Edom, you know? Yeah, I read it, uh, Jeremiah 51 and 7, verse 6. It's not with a revelation. No. Um, they shall hate the whore. And this is um right, this is a love hate thing. I mean, these, these people are weird, man. They want to make the money off the horn, but they get no press. And, and can't wait for the, the horn to be taken down. The people are fucking weird, man. And this is Isaiah 36 and 6. Lo, thou trust in the staff that broke the reed on Egypt. What well, and uh Revelation that they took it, and this is New Egypt right here. Well, on if a man lean it, it will go into his hand and pierce it. So it was Pharaoh keep the feet to all that trust in him, to all man. Everybody that got in league with this with this whore man, you've all been um been got up in this trap. Like you said, you know, that that, that golden cup that Lord got y'all to drink up and now put y'all in the same boat to get part of this judgment with, with this damn devil, man. All right. So y'all gonna lean upon that broken reed. And what's that broken reed? You go into um the word canula. All right, which means small reason. The same instrument they put the chip in with. And this, this is how the whole world is now. Um, damn. The whole world is already going digital. The whole the whole world is already on the RFID, for the most part, already going down there route to, to on the RFID chip. India, they got rid of most of their paper currency. Most of them are as digital. China, most of them is digital. Even in Africa, man. They use um, their phone payments, man. Esau has already set the world up for this damn fall. You should have never trusted this fucking devil. Now the world is already set up to get hit with this market of peace, man. All right? Hey, damn, that's cold. They already getting the market of peace. Some are already, some are already actually getting implanted with it. Some are just on the precursor leading up to it. Like China, you know? It was this, it's this show on YouTube I, I was watching. I don't know how I can. This it was suggested. It's clear I watch it. And there was this guy bootleg and shit. He was going to buy bootleg shit. And all the marks he went to, they all used the same uh, phone app payments, man. That's how they operate. They wasn't using cash. They are prepared to make transactions off a of digital currency. All right? You should never trust this devil, man. They want to crash the market so they can get y'all to get shit, man. 
the new relations have fallen hook, line, and sinker. Damn, this is Revelation 13 to 16. I'm going to start up, actually, man. Damn. <laughs> Damn. This Revelation, because it, yep. Yeah, we keep in mind that Becky 2 said because he transgresses by wine, he's a problem that need to keep it at home. And that wine goes to his doctors, his philosophies. All right, so he went and took that to the world. And this is Revelation 13. And 11. And I beheld another beast coming up out of the earth. And he had two horns like a lamb, and he spake as a dragon. So he, he made things look cool. Yeah, you get on board with this, this debt based system. You know, here's a loan so you can mine your, your resources. You can get rich like America. You know, you two can become great. Meanwhile, they spoke as a dragon, man. All right? They, they was lying and deceiving. So, so they could gain control over the, their lands and shit. Because they know, they, like it says in Proverbs, the lender becomes servant. To, no, the borrower becomes servant to the lender. All right? So all this was a setup. So he's off to gain control over y'all, man. With his philosophy, man. His wisdom. And he exercised all the power of the first beast before him. And it caused the earth to deal with where they went to worship the first beast. Whose daily wound was he? Because he got the whole world to get in league with the EU and NATO, man. All right, he used America as the, the face of the company to, to convince the world to get in league with them to seek after the love of money, man. All right, now everybody's following these devils, man. As they say, yeah, we're alone. It is that's another thing. We're alone. It is and when it comes time to vote in um in, in the UN, all right, or, or you vote our way. You are you will be you are send your troops with our troops to fight. We'll give you this amount of defense shit. They, all this shit was a, a huge trick. It all started with a loan, with the hope of you two can be rich. Here's some money. With interest. Damn. Verse 13. And he do a great wonder so that he make a fire come down from heaven on the earth in the sight of men. All right, you, you get down with us, or you suffer like the, those who did. They got hit with missiles, man. All right, look at the country that did that don't. Uh, um, Got a central bank. They get fucked up. All right? Or the ones that got a central bank and tried and tried to get off of the live with the doctor. He tried to get gold going again and, and unite the northern region of Africa. And got we got his ass smoked. All right. They this is the power they use, man. They use their military might. Dropping bombs out of heaven, and that's part of those miracles, right? And, um, and he doing great wonders. So that he made a fire come down from heaven on the earth in the sight of men and deceiving them that dwell on the earth by the means of those miracles which he had power to do in the sight of the beast. All right, so from his military might, those miracles and the miracles, and, and as far as they're concerned, to make nations rich. And this is a miracle for China to have gone from what their status was, and now they're the powerhouse. That's one of those miracles. And then, yeah, we got to leave with that shit, second hand decision. The guy in league with Babylon bought all of the bad American debt up, you know, and that was building him up as a country. But really, all they did was follow after this, this beast, man, follow after the beast of Rome to perform its will, man. And they'll keep going. All right? And deceiving them that dwell on the earth by the means of those miracles, which you have power to do in the sight of the beast, saying to them that dwell on the earth that they should make an image to the beast. Which had the woman by a sword and did live. All right, so everybody follows what the so called white man calls humane, or the, so, the rules the so called white man sets so, up, even for war. Everybody follows whatever the so called white man set up. All right, this is the issue. Look what happened in Japan. Now look at their fucking nation. They out there. Uh, Everything's over sexualized, it's just sweet and moral. But look, they think it's true because the economy is All right, that's part of the trick. And he had power to give life unto the image of the beast, that's part of the deceit. He had power to give life unto the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should boast and call that his enemy and not worship the image of the beast should be killed. Those that didn't do the reason. You and NATO, they set up a great death, man. So, for everybody else, at some point, one way or another, they got to get it. Whether it's through America, through Europe, or, or, or France, 
small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their poor heads, and that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. There is wisdom that him that have, him that have understanding count the number of the beast, what is the number of a man, and his number is 600, three score and six. All right, let's talk about RFID uh, uh, technologies, man, being tiny. Right, that word mark there is karamba, which means an incision, a cut, something that goes to the flesh. The same as that broken reed. It said, you trust in Pharaoh, you're going to lean on that broken reed. And all you nations have been trusted in, 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 in Pharaoh, man. Y'all been drinking that golden cup because you thought you was going to be rich like them. All right, that you that uh, uh, things are going to continue like this, man. And all it's doing is that mark of the beast is coming, man. All right, that's it, that's all. You, you people are set up. To receive the chip. The system is already in place. You got something? No. You know? Well, I think right. that, that was the grand scheme of things, you know? That, that was the grand scheme. That's the all oh, that's to build up for what, man? Uh, you see the um the Georgia Guidestones keep humanity under five hundred million, man. Because why? Because that's manageable in the eyes of Esau Edom, man. Have everybody chipped. You got cameras everywhere, GPSs, man. He want to be God, man. <laughs> you know, this is his whole plan. This is his whole MO. Right. Right to get y'all to worship him, man. Follow his way. It is Revelation 14 and 9. And the third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, If any man worship the beast and his image and receive his mark in his forehead or in his hand, the same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of the Most High. Which is poured out without mixture into the cup of his indignation. He shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb. And the smoke of their torment ascended up forever and ever. And they have no rest day nor night who worship the beast and his image, whosoever received the mark of his name. <coughs> so great destruction is going to come upon you all, man. All right, like I said, you drink that. The Lord used Esau weed to get y'all to drink this cup. All right? And now that the, the, the rest of that cup is coming, man, the other part of it, which is destruction. All right? So prepare for that World War III. Prepare for it, all type of chaos. And it's coming, man. All right? These nations going to bite Esau, which means Esau's going to have to uh, uh, bite, bite back, man. All right? The RFID is coming, man. All right? So with that, that's something. Hopefully this is edifying. All praise is out in glory too. Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shah, Bahasham, Akash, Kodash. Double honest to the apostles. The South Asian brothers doing this thing is sincere and truth and with charity. Shalom. Bob or Paul. Yeah, the brother put that. That's a good precept. Maybe not even put it.